Hi, uh, this is a quick video demonstrating um, how I modified a blade, um, one of their basic controllers that comes with the MSRX and the MCPX2 and some of the other ones. Um, it's been around for a few years actually. Um, how I modified it so that uh, it hooks up to my Android phone and uh, that I can do some basic reading of the, uh, of the values. So I just wrote this app. Uh, last night and a little bit into today. So when I plug in the, uh, the USB, the app will come up. And it comes up with just all zero values because I've got the controller off. When I turn on the controller, you'll see values engage. And as I move the sticks, sorry for the glare, there we go. As I move the sticks, the values change. Uh, this app was really easy to write, um, and uh, I used a lot of information that a bunch of other people had already figured out on the web to do this. So all I really had to do was write a basic app that would read the serial data, parse it properly, and display it. Um, so the next step is flipping this connection around. Um, the wireless module on the inside of this controller basically takes serial from the board uh, that reads the joysticks, and I'm reading that serial now to display it on my screen, but I can flip the connection around so that my phone is actually controlling the wireless module and basically making it so that I can fly my helicopter with my phone. So that's what I'm going to be doing soon. I'll release all this code as open source uh, somehow, one way or another. Um, but of course this can be done with a computer too, but I'm actually better at programming Android these days um, than the new Mac that I just got. So. That's all.